Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Um, it's currently Monday morning, and we are down in Anaheim just visiting Sean's family and everything. We came down Saturday night, and then yesterday, like, I didn't vlog it, but we spent all day with his family by the pool and just, like, swimming. If you like soaking up the sun, really enjoying being outside. And I kind of, today, today I want to do a beach day trip, which is what we're going to do. I think we're going to go over to Huntington because it's kind of close. And we haven't been in so long. And I really, really, really want to get bonsai bowls. If you're not familiar with it, um, I think they have them in a few other, like, states. Like, I know they have them in Hawaii. I'm not sure where else. But they have them, like, in Southern California. They're just giant acai bowls. And they're, like, not expensive. It's my favorite place, like, hands down to get acai bowls. So we're going to go do that. And then we're also going to go to Wahoo's Fish Tacos and go there because that's another one of my favorite places to eat that we don't have like next to our house so that's what i'm looking forward to most today and then of course we're gonna like go to the beach and have a good day so i figured why not vlog because it's a little bit different than what we have been doing just at home working and stuff like that so i hope you guys have fun with this vlog because i'm excited for the day i think i'm going to get ready right now and then i will catch up with you guys in a little bit and the girlies are with us hello Gracie's literally being so lazy today. You guys ready for the beach? Yes. Sean's like, oh, literally look at how big it is. And then Sean's walking the girls up there because <laughs> I'm not walking too slow. Okay guys, so obviously I'm really bad at vlogging. I need to get back into it. I already think I said it on my last vlog. Um, but it's the next day. I just got off of work and I think I'm gonna do a little bit of a haul right now because I did get some packages that came in. So that should be fun. So let me just show you first what I got. And actually these earrings will be the first ones. They're from Sunstruck. Um, I will have her linked below her Instagram account. They're super inexpensive. All of her stuff is handmade um, and it's all super cute and it like holds up really well too. And so these earrings just came in. I think they were like, she had like a discount point. So I think they were like, they're under $15, I think. I'm almost positive. I know all of her stuff is, on, is like 10 to $15. So I picked up these earrings and I also got a few other pieces that I will show you right now. Okay, so on top of these earrings, which they're just like, they have the three little pearls. I also picked up, which this might be one of my favorite pieces, this choker. And it's just pearls and then it has like the colorful beads in between. And I just think this is so cute, especially for summer. And then I also picked up because I need more necklaces for layering. So I picked up this like little evil eye one and it's on the gold chain. And I got my necklaces in the 16 inch and then I got this one in the 14, 15 inch. And I also got this like single pearl disc necklace and it's on the chain and it's just a really cute plain um, white pearl. So I figured these ones would be good for layering. But yeah, these came in today and I'm already placing my second order too because she she literally like she puts new stuff up every week and I am so obsessed with everything she puts up. So like I said, I will have it linked down below, but she is just like, I think it's Shop Sunstruck on Instagram. So definitely check her out. Okay, I'm just gonna make this like a little collective haul, but the next place um, I got stuff from um, is Lulu's, and I really, you're gonna see, I got all dresses, just because it's a lot more easier for me to do whenever I'm like going to work. Really easy outfit ideas, like I literally just throw a dress on with sneakers or sandals, and I'm good for the day, and it looks like I tried, even though it literally took me two minutes to get ready. And so from Lulu's, the first thing I got is this really pretty floral dress. And it has like the cinching or what is this, the ruching? Like, I don't know, is it elastic? All the way down and then that's what the bottom looks like. This one is so, so cute. And I wish we could do like brunch and stuff, but all the like restaurants and bars did close this week in LA. So probably won't be wearing this one for a while, but luckily it stays pretty warm down here. So hopefully we can wear this soon. And then I have a wedding coming up in August. 
so I'm gonna wear one of these dresses like that I'm gonna be showing you and so I got this one first which I think I'm just gonna wear it to work too it has this like really pretty like floral print on top and it buttons all the way down with the white buttons and it's like orange and red striped and then it's a maxi dress and it has like this really frilly bottom with the floral print on it as well so I think I'm this is a contender to wear to the swagging I have in August just because it is so pretty and summery and I'm just really obsessed with this one. And also all these dresses were on the sale section, by the way, fun fact. This is like one of my favorite dresses ever. I got so many compliments on it. It's like pattern patchwork, which you're gonna see this trend of all the dresses I ordered. I'm obsessed with pattern patchwork right now. And so I got this one and it has like the black floral and then like this red one and like red and black. And it's like a little tie dress and has frilly sleeves, but this one probably goes to like, I would say mid calf. And I'm obsessed with it. I wore this instantly with like white Nikes and it was just, it was so cute. I seriously love this dress. And I think this one's still on the website too and it's on there. It's on sale as well. And then the last thing I got from Lou's was just this little like clip set. And the whole reason I got it was because of the, this like diamond clip at the bottom with like the dangling chains. Um, I haven't really found like figured out how to style this yet. This yet. It looked really cute on the model, I will say, because she had like short hair. And it was blonde and super curly so it looked really cute on her and then it came with like two pearl ones but this is the reason i got it so i need to figure out how to style it because i'm obsessed with it down to kith really quick i don't know like i'm sure you guys i don't know if you know if kith is, what kith is it's like below fred siegel in west hollywood it's like a sneaker store but they also have like clothing and then they have like their kith treats which is their ice cream section and i picked up these babies i saw them um I saw them on like someone posted a picture of them wearing them and I was like oh my gosh and so I ran down the kit the next day to see if they had them and they did and it's just the polka dot con de garçons and I have the plain um white high top converse it's like not really focusing on it but yeah I got these ones just because I think these are so cute and they're really fun to wear with like a like I would probably I usually wear them with like jeans or like white pants and a white like vintage t-shirt and then this just kind of adds a little bit of a pattern pop to it so I'm so obsessed with these. These are my new babies right now. Part of this haul is Forever 21. I did see that they had a lot of patchwork dresses that were super cute and inexpensive. And a lot of these are still on. I'll try to link whatever is that I can find or like similar ones for Forever 21 and Lulu's. But I got, the first one I got is this like short, like kind of mini dress, but it has the patchwork in it. And I accidentally ordered, you'll see, you'll see, you'll see. Um, but it has like the little tie front and the puffy sleeves. And I just think this would be so cute with my white Air Forces and really like throw on some gold jewelry and accessorizing. And I think this is just like perfect for summer. Like there's all the different floral patchwork. I'm just, I love it. And <laughs> I got the same one. I didn't realize like they were super similar, like mixes of patterns, but I got this one, but it's not like the same style. It is like a different style dress. So it has like the button sleeve and the V cut and like more like loose hanging sleeves and it like this is how tall it is too it has like the kind of frilly cinched bottom but i also got that one in this orange color which i thought was super fun because i don't have a lot of like orange and i did want to get some more colors into my closet so this one's the exact same style just like the orange pattern like i said so this one's definitely more fun for summertime um i think i'm probably gonna wear this this week it is a little bit shorter than I would like on me. Um, so yeah, whatever I don't wear, I think I might just return. But I usually find a way to wear all this stuff. So yeah, this one's super cute. Okay, the next one I was going to wear like for the 4th of July, like if we did celebrate, but we didn't end up like really celebrating it. But I got this one, which I feel like I can wear anytime. I got it to wear to work. It's this like blue stripes one with like this stitch detailing, like the outlining. But the only thing I didn't realize is that it has really high slits on the slide, on the side. And this probably goes to like right below my knees. And I just don't like the slits come up way a little like higher than I would want because I wanted to wear it to work. So I think I'm gonna take it to work and have our tailor like close this, close the seams. It's on both sides. It's just, you know, not what I was thinking. I did not see this on the model at all, so I'm gonna have it closed because it's just a maxi dress and it's a little bit more appropriate to wear to work and the next one I've already worn <laughs> it is this long maxi dress and it has this really fun print on it and then it has a different print on the bottom and it has like the oranges and pinks 
and this one is like really comfortable it has like the stretchy back too and i got smalls in all these dresses by the way too and so i'm really obsessed with this one i just wore it with like um platform sandals and like did like a bunch of like gold act like accessorizing and earrings and it was super cute i got a lot of compliments on it last but not least since i got this box of like all the forever 21 stuff i've been wearing this one literally non-stop it's the only dress i took with me down at orange county this weekend and it's all i wore like it was just too hot to wear shorts or anything so i just ended up throwing this on at all times and it's super cute because you can like adjust it and mess with the tie things because these untie the sleeves too and honestly it was super cute because then i ended up knotting it in the front so it was a little bit um shorter and yeah it's just a maxi dress but i love it it's really pretty super comfortable too the last place is brandy melville i only picked up one thing because i was literally i had to go over to westlake village for like something for work like i had to do i forgot i had to do something for work over there and so there was notice there was a brandy melville so i picked up this because i was literally obsessed with this color and i know i like wanted this whole like year i've been talking about how i want to do all neutrals and only do neutrals in my closet well that totally changed this summer i'm like loving pops of color right now and so i got this like mint green like sweater tank but it's like not warm at all like it's super comfortable i've literally worn this already so many times and i think i'm gonna go back and see if they have more colors because i love it like and i want to wear this with So my whole plan when I ordered this necklace was because I had already gotten this shirt and I wanted to wear this necklace with this shirt and I just think it's super cute so I'm probably going to wear it next week because I already wore it last week to work. But yeah, I thought that was adorable. And I'm going to try to find more like I know I usually go to like Nordstrom or PacSun for my brandy stuff just because it, it's like too much to go into the brandy store sometimes. But they don't have any but like shirts like that anywhere and I want to pick up a few more colors like their blue color that they really have I love so I want to go get those um so I think I might just well oh, I think I hope retail's still open I really don't know right now but as long as retail stays open I think I'm just gonna make the trip to Brandy and get another one of them but then I also picked up this like little bracelet excuses I got this from the pool this weekend I don't know it's like some weird kind of brand I got this like gold bracelet with white beads just because their bracelets are only four dollars and they don't turn very quickly at all at least for me they don't and so i got it to have like a stackable bracelet and then um these bracelets they're half pearl half white will be on my website later this week um they are handmade by me and i'm like trying to push a lot more handmade jewelry just because it is what i enjoy doing and i feel like people appreciate that whole handmade jewelry piece a lot more i know i do at least like and i always try to support brands that are handmade or small business so I'm really excited about where we're gonna go with our jewelry, our jewelry collection. And then this one's another one. Oh my God. So the camera totally just popped off right now, like literally popped off. I don't know why, um, but I don't even know what I was saying. These two are both from Midnight Muse. This one's already up on our website. I'll have it linked down below. I always get asked about my jewelry. And then this one is gonna be up on our website soon. And since I get asked about a jewelry, I'm just gonna go through it all right now. This is made by Mary. I'll have her necklace linked down below. And then this one is like one that's like tangled up in it right now. But this is also from Midnight Muse. It's just our little like chain link necklace that I always like wear for stacking. And yeah, that's all the jewelry I have on right now. I usually wear rings, but with everything going on and how much I've been washing my hands, I like haven't been doing it lately. But and I probably won't be doing it for a while because it's just easier to keep them off and wash my hands constantly at work. But yeah, that's it for the haul. This whole video just turned to be in a collective haul. So we'll see what I do for the rest of the night, but either way, I'll come back to end this vlog. Okay, so third try trying to do this outro, but it's a little later on in the night and I am currently just getting ready for bed, but I wanted to hop on really quick. I'm gonna mention this face mask that I've been loving. I am gonna do an updated skincare favorites probably before the end of this month or early August, whenever I get around doing it. But I'm gonna do a face mask right now because my face has been breaking out really bad on my chin. And I'm not sure if it's from wearing a mask or not, but I also haven't been wearing makeup. So my only other thing is the, ma the mask. Um, so I have been trying to do face masks more. It's just this herbal face mask with peppermint from Earth Body Botanicals. And I have mentioned this mask before, I think. I will have a link down below too, because it's like one product that I just use constantly, especially whenever I'm like breaking out. 
and it's actually Bose Cousins line of skincare cosmetics and they're she makes them all by hand they're all natural and clean which is something I love and I will have her Etsy link down below if I didn't already mention that but I'm gonna do that really quick and then head off to bed but I do just want to do my outro really quick and say thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. It was really all over the place. It was not supposed to be like a collective haul. It was supposed to be a beach vlog, but it didn't end up happening. Um, so yeah, if you guys have any video suggestions, leave them down in the comments. If you guys have any questions, leave them down in the comments. I will try to link everything um, needed in this video. Other than that, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.